So let's go into the next tool item here, which is the roll edit. If I expand this menu, it's the second one down, or if I just hit the letter N, it chose, chooses the rolling edit tool. Now what the roll edit does is I notice as I bring it over here, it's X'd out. I bring it over to the side here, it's X'd out. If I put it in the middle of these two edits, it's no longer X'd out. That means I can grab this edit and I can change this clip's out point while simultaneously changing this clip's in point. Watch what happens when I start to drag this. It'll bring up that little double window again. And as I drag this to the left, you notice that the in point and the out point is happening at the same time. So as I move this to the right, same thing. The uh, endpoint and the out point are changing at the same time. So this is simultaneously changing this uh, one clip's out point while changing another, while, and compensating while changing uh, the adjacent clip's uh, endpoint. So if I want to change, so I've got this match, and let's say I want to change where this edit actually occurs. Um, I could even perform a uh, what's called called a, a J cut edit here. Uh, I could lock my audio down here and just ripple the and just roll edit the video here and grab this over to the right and find a point. And now I have this guy speaking before it cuts to the next shot here. So as we play through that, so as we play through this, I'm just glad she's finally at rest. I guess that's the way to look at things. And this is called a J cut there. But uh, but I, I can do that to the audio as, as well as the video. Uh, if I grab a clip over here and I drag this to the left, once again, it's showing uh, my endpoint and out point. It's showing my endpoint and out point changing simultaneously. And that's what the roll edit does. Very helpful.